everybody welcome back to a brand new video in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how to get a free custom slash vanity url for your discord server so that your invites look clean i will be doing it using disc.gg but i will be making other tutorials on how to do it with other services if you guys want a maybe more clean url but anyways guys let's get into the video well, actually, before we get into the video, make sure to join my Discord server, link down in the description if you need any help, or generally, if you guys want to join the community, I'm also opening a Minecraft server soon, I will have both Discord servers linked in the description, so make sure to go ahead and join, join them, and also, like and subscribe, why not? Anyways, guys, let's get into the video. So guys, first of all, obviously, you're going to want to uh, open the URL in the description that will lead to disk.gg or just type disk.gg in your browser, but I will have a URL down below. So first of all, guys, once you're here, you're just going to click on launch dashboard or login. So if you're not logged in, it'll show here like a logout, a login thing, which, you know, you can just log in and all you got to do is authorize using Discord. So guys, once you've actually logged in, you're just going to click on launch dashboard. This is actually way better than invite GG, which is what I showed in my previous tutorial. So all you guys got to do here is click create new link and you can choose from a bunch of things. You can make up to four free URLs. And if you guys want more and no, you know, you can do stuff like this, which is actually kind of useful. You guys can upgrade to premium, which let's see the price of that. Oh, so it's just, it's just, ten dollars it's a one-time price that's actually a really good price so you know i might actually get that myself but if you guys are interested you know make sure to get that they also have disc.gg slash top which is pretty pretty damn cool so they have like a leaderboard with clicks and stuff so that's actually pretty damn cool but anyways guys um hopefully enjoyed today's tutorial that was pretty much it it was very short and yeah i'll see you guys in the next video